and today I'm going to show you a project that I did by myself that I got from YouTube. What I did is, as you can see, this is a squishy egg and it bounces. Okay, well what, what was the title of your experiment? Bouncy egg. Bouncy egg, okay. And what materials did you need? I needed vinegar. But How much? One little tiny cup. But since we didn't have regular vinegar, we used this vinegar, and then we needed an egg, and we... With the shell, right? It had the shell included? Yeah, it had the shell included, and then what we had to do is we put the egg inside of the cup with the vinegar. So a raw egg. Well, yeah. Or it was raw. Egg. It wasn't cooked or anything. Well, okay. Yeah, it was raw. And we waited 24 hours, and this is what it came out to. But first you had to wash it and... Did you have to take off the the shell? Was no. there any shell left or no? Yeah, there was that white stuff. Uh, what I just did is I, I was just keep on putting the water and then I was just like scrape, scraping it gently on my hand so that the white stuff can come off. And these okay. are all the papers that I had. <clears throat> so what was your hypothesis? My hypothesis was... I think it will turn into a bouncy egg. Okay. And let's see. <clears throat> Your observation, you said it took you how long? It took 24 hours and it turned into a ball. Can you show us on the counter? No, your bouncy ball, like your bouncy oh, egg. Well, Show I us how it bounces. I can't bounce it that high or else it's going to pop just like I just popped one right now <laughs> over there. Okay. <laughs> and then if you look at it super close, you can see the yolk a little. Mm-hmm. see? Cool. It's crazy, huh? Bounce it a little on the table, on the counter. Oh, wow. So that's just one cup of vinegar and one raw egg, and it was left in a cup. For one 24 cup of, hours. One cup of vinegar for 24 hours. Okay. And so your conclusion is? My conclusion is, my conclusion is the vinegar burnt the white, like the, shell. the stuff that's, shell. the shell, and then also the stuff that's surrounding the yolk. Mm. Okay. So it turned it into a bouncy ball. A yeah, bouncy and then egg. basically, do you know like that rubber piece that's surrounding? Mm -hmm. Like whenever you make deviled eggs, like I don't know what it's called. Rubber. It's like a film, yeah. Like that rubber piece. Mm -hmm. That this is a rubber. Oh, that makes sense. Uh huh. And it just hardened it a little bit. So, the first one when you cracked it, I it, bounced it like this. It's all liquid inside, bounced, right? Yeah. Do you want to do it? Mm -hmm. You don't need that egg for school, right? No. You don't need to take anything. Yeah. Okay. Okay. So show us how that film just was hardened. Can I do it? Pop no. Pop. Let me give you a, a fork here. Okay, so this is what happened when I had bounced it too high. Yeah. <laughs> that's crazy. So that's the little film that you were talking about? Yeah. This, oh. this is like the rubber and this is all like the liquid. I think you're right, Johnny. I think it is the, the little film from the inside of the egg. And then, wow. so then, whenever, whenever, you, whenever, instead of cracking the stuff, you can mm -hmm. just get all of these, and then just, and then just do that, and then, so then, instead of cracking them, all that you just have to do is just pop it. Mm -hmm. I wonder if you leave it longer, if it'll turn everything into, like, rubber. No. What do you think? No, because, remember, we had left oh, it at 416, mm -hmm. and I barely took it out, like, what, like a... 4.16 p.m. you mean? Yeah, 4.16 p.m. and then I barely took it out at... Mom, where's my egg? Hold on. At 3.45. Mm -hmm. Mom, where's my egg? Hold on, Mama. Okay, Jonathan. Well, thank you so much for sharing that with us. Like. Subscribe, like, subscribe. Comment below. Comment below. If you have any questions, let us know. In the comments. In the comments. Okay, bye. Goodbye. Thanks for watching.